We're going to do a fruit mukbang for you. No cooked food today. Woo-hoo. So, yeah. What have you got here first? You show them up a close. red dragon fruit. So give it stay there a bit. It am. It's there. <laughs> and, yeah, this one is a dark purple on the inside. Some of them are white. Magenta. So, this is why you call it a red dragon fruit, not because of the outside. Then we've got Chempadak, which is grown normally in northern Thailand and other places of Asia. Very rare to come by a lot of time, but it seems it's in season. And it's super, super soft. So that means it's ripe. Most people eat underripe. And then it's all latex because it's a latexy fruit. And the aroma is so, so strong. You can smell it in the whole room. It's strong, isn't it, Janessa? Yes, very. Oh, apparently you've got a knife to open it, so that's going to be interesting. Are you going to eat that first? I am. Yeah, so you can eat that and try not to get it over the white pillows that you're sitting on. I'll be very careful. <laughs> Janessa's is going to be doing some filming as well. Um, but yeah, I have no idea how I'm going to open this. Like, Let's at see all. what this looks like by doing this right mm. here. There you go. So I'm going to open with the teeth. Actually, you ought to want to t- film me doing this as well, quickly. Oh, yeah. Sir. <laughs> Careful with the mukbang table as well. Yeah. We're going to speed up at certain points, but yeah. Wait. It's going to be hard to open in the way that I would like to open it. Ooh, baby. <laughs> that is sexy. <laughs> <laughs> So, because it's quite small, it actually hasn't oh, got wow. a lot of flesh. Jeez, there's no fruit. Yeah, there's not that much in there, but look at this stuff. That's the fruit there. That's the granddaddy of the fruits. Oh, <sighs> dropping it there. Look at that. But yeah, when you get big ones, there's a lot of flesh. I knew that it wasn't a very, very big one, but didn't have much choice. There is more around the other side. If you crack her open like this, now you can see her fully. She is the one. And this stuff is super, super soft. Look at this. Anyway, try Chemberdak. Oh my god. I haven't had this in a very long time. Mmm. Oh. It's so soft, like, I don't know if you can see this, but as soon as you chew it, it just turns to complete mush. Mm. Okay, my turn. Try that first. Mm-hmm. Can you save me at least one piece of that? Mm-hmm. Try one. Try one. Yeah, this is just the start. We've got boxes and boxes of durian that's been taken out of the shell. Seriously, man. People that eat a keep chain diet, don't eat that. <laughs> I love fruit. Who seriously doesn't like sugary stuff? We're meant to like sugary stuff. We're designed for it. But naturally occurring sugar. I don't know where my trouble is, to be honest. I don't know, but they don't want to keep you here and talking about it, though. <laughs> <laughs> you. Okay, I'm gonna have some dragon fruit. You know how to open it like a pro? No. I usually just open it right there and then. Right there. Right here? Mm hmm. And pin it down, make it into like a plow. Yeah, Ooh. this stuff. It's super, super sweet. It tastes like a combination of like brown sugar, bubble gum, oh. and sugar cane juice. Oh my god. Mm. And when I tried this before, I really didn't like it. Look at that color! Mmm. Um, 
not that good. What? The ones in uh, Copenhagen were sweeter. Really? Mm hmm. Or about maybe the same. I don't know. You said they weren't so good there. I don't think you know what you're talking about with dragon fruit. <laughs> Show them the inside. How if I hold it? Oh. Tons of seeds inside. So many. You can see all of them when they come out the other side. Mm. They have a naturally carried oil on them all. Which works as a brilliant laxative. Mm. By far one of the mm. best fruits to oh. get you up. It's getting sweeter. Yeah, because they're the sweetest in the middle. Look right here. Mm -hmm. mm. I take it back. You're not in the middle of the camera, by the way. You're like on the corner. I know, I'm just afraid of the pillow getting red. Mm. I think I'm bleeding. And yeah, no. I, you could say this is a dead fruit on there, look. It's that I've destroyed. It doesn't look disgusting to me though. Maybe it does to you, but you ever had that on there and then mm. a dead animal on there? Mm. Oh my god. So sweet in the middle. Wow. I've never had a dragon fruit like that. Um, which one would be a bit hidden being not a dead animal at all? This bright colour, sweet smelling, and then dead rotting flesh. Like oh my god. Didn't I tell you earlier that it's the best dragon fruit I'm like in, in Malaysia? Shock right now. I've been eating really bad dragon fruit. Mm. When it's Chiang Mai, dragon fruit seasons, you can get one like that for months. Mm. I had some in Chiang Mai though that weren't good. I, me and Ted Carl are pretty much the only person that's buying the decent one. Mmm. Wow. The middle. <laughs> it's like candy. Right, a healthy version. Mmm. Yeah. And the color. Just so beautiful. I love mixing it in smoothies because it just turns the whole thing pink. Mm. Yeah, don't be scared of the fruit. Am I going to have any of that? Fruit is good for you. Well, I just looked, and lucky I looked when there's one piece oh left. Oh my god, I was about to be so upset. Uh. I'm glad it wasn't bigger because it's so sweet. Like, it was too much sweetness. You want some of this? No, sir. Really? I don't think I can eat it all. You're gonna have to. It's very filling though, and I don't want to spoil my appetite. Feeling. <laughs> it's very filling. Look out. It's huge and so much water in it. It will digest very quickly. Mm. Oh my god. Yeah, you can tell this is so ripe because the latex isn't sticky at all. When it's underripe, it just stick to you. I think you should try this now. Okay. No, I found another one. Alright. Um, she said she's tried one before and, and it, it hasn't was been bad. Good. I admit she tried a good one. I give everyone the best fruit I'm experiences afraid. because I used to eat a fruit based diet and I'm a fruit point so my tongue's red mm. okay the texture oh my she's like a child <laughs> texture's a bit different I don't want to say bad, but... It's like a marshmallow. It's like it wants to be jackfruit, but then it's like... It's not meant to be jackfruit. I know. I can't believe you don't like it. I'll take that. Wait! 
kind of tastes like egg fruit. <laughs> oh, seriously. The texture. Mmm. I really don't. I'm weird about some textures. I don't like the texture of that. The flavor is good though. It's like brown sugar. What a letdown. What? Well, I'm not complaining. It's more for me to eat. Well, I mean, you did eat it all. <laughs> dead carcass. So, yeah. Mm. And let's go down this good line really quickly because it's really high water content. It's very ripe. Um, she's going to finish that. And then oh, yeah. we shall move on to the best part of them all. Durian! We've got so many varieties. Well, I've got loads of varieties. She ain't got that much, but yeah. Let's see how they go. Mm. I can't even believe this. Yeah, I couldn't have a bit more than this. I could have bit be too much. I can't believe you didn't like it, so. Mm. The texture, I don't like it. Mm, definitely like a child. Have you been told that? Children are really funny with a lot of things. <laughs> I am a child. A big child. Mmm! That was the best bite. It's good I told you to get that, wasn't it? Oh my god. It's really good, so. You got a nice pink face, you can show them. <laughs> and pink hands. And now pink hair. Could your hair in it? <laughs> no! Where? Get it! Where is it? I can't get it off, I've got jackfruit all in my hand. This is a jackfruit! <laughs> Don't argue <laughs> <cousin. laughs> And so it begins. No, please! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> ah! No, no, you're on the legs. So, as you can see, we've got a lot of durian here that's come out of the shell and in the boxes because you're yeah, not allowed it in a hotel, so we had to sneak it in. A bit more inconspicuous when you haven't got a big spiky durian. Well, loads of them. As you can see, there's a lot here. Um, I'm not sure how much it will come to. I'll put it down below if I can work it out. Two of these are Janessa's, the rest is mine. <laughs> um, so yeah, we got some, let's, let's, let's show you them up. So we've got some D6000, I've got a lot of D6000. It's the one I've got the most of. Looking very soft and wrinkly. Wrinkly. It's definitely a bitter variety. You can smell that bitteriness. Mm. Um, this is another D6000. These three boxes are definitely D3000, all of them ones. Um, I actually put some of them, no, actually we leave them there. Also some D604. That one, the D6000 is a more yellowy color. This one is a light yellow. This one definitely smells like a fattier, creamier, sweeter version. And it looks pretty damn good to me. Then we also have the D14, which looks very similar to the D6000. Very, very wrinkly again. Same, same, but different. As you can see here, just absolutely divine. Just the way we like the durian. Um, now I'm getting confused of which one's which. So that was the D14. And I need to put that one back there and throw them all <laughs> on the floor and I'm not gonna remember which one's which and put them all back on. And then we've got something that is meant to be red prawn. Doesn't look like red prawn to me. Uh. 
Red prawn's normally more orange, so... The other ones are oranger than that. Not sure what that actually is. Still looking forward to it. Maybe smell. Slight bittery smell to it, but also a creamy hmm. sweet smell. It smells a bit bitter. Um, it's two boxes of them right there. Then we've got D12. This one is... No! Yes. D12, yeah. Because I remember that one. Very slight. Some creamy, sweet smell similar to the other one. What do you smell? I smell all of them. Um, Ooh, I like that smell one. That's really then... Nice. You've got your one. No, that's my one, this sorry. Is Yours mine. is mine underneath. So I've got Shao Shu Han. Shu Han. Han. This one looks amazing. It's got yellow smells, yellow, sorry, colours, orange tints on it as well. Orange. Ooey gooey. Orange. <laughs> uh, so put that on. What's your one? Mine is. Kunpo. Why did I not get any of that? How did, how did that happen? I don't know. I just got lucky. Hmm. It has a very light smell. And it's very orange-ish yellow. Yeah, a, yeah, that's the one. And then I have no idea what this one on the right is. Do you? <laughs> Something? <laughs> Question mark. Looking pretty yellow as well. And this one is Root Pie Boing? Boing? So I got that, I don't know. That's, that's it. This one is really dense. I think that's going to be one of the best ones actually. This one looks so creamy. A lot of them are going to look the same. Look at that. Oh, Tiffany's going to be <laughs> watering over this video, her friend. She's a very queen lover. Um, I already showed you that one, yet yeah, D6, yeah, that's the lot. So, now we're going to start feasting on these. And I actually need to move a bit because What's up? this table is digging into my knees. Ow! Ow! That's a bit better. Ow! So, let's dig in, shall we? Yes. We opened all of the boxes, we put the la not labels, Lids underneath because they've got written on there which ones are which. I don't know which one I'm going to go for first. Hmm. Which one are you going for first? Shu Han. I'm going for this one. This is the Shu Han. I haven't tried this one before. D12? This one? Doesn't have a lid. You, you need to try yours. Mine. <laughs> which one are you going to try? Yeah, out of your ones, I mean. Kunpo. It's hard to get up close. Mm. Wow, it just melts in my mouth like butter. What? It tastes like yogurt. Mm. Whoa. It's got nice chewiness to it as well. The skim. I'm not sure how I feel about this. This reminds me a bit like a saveloy. Mm -mm -mm. mm. It actually, it's tasting like a sausage. Oh. <laughs> it tastes like. Nice spicy mustard. <laughs> <laughs> God. Tastes like Dijon mustard. This is Mine tastes like a Frankfurt of sausages. <laughs> oh my god. Can I try? You wanna try mine? It tastes like a meat eating sausage, but it's sweet. Wow. Mine is so bitter, it's not sweet at all. <laughs> <laughs> ah. There's nothing. Yours is it does taste like sausage! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yours is amazing. Mmm. Yours is super, super fatty, super thick. Doesn't it taste like mustard though? 
No. Spicy mustard. No, it hasn't got much of a taste. Mmm. I like that. Sausage. Where are you putting that? Yeah, hers is nice. It's not a very pungent taste, but it's very fatty, very creamy. I'm not so keen on the really fatty variety. Yeah, this is a sweet but savoury one. I'm going to try a different one. Definitely tastes like saucy. Mmm. Yeah, that's some during to bitter, some sweet, some are sour, some are savoury. Mm-mm-mm. This one's much better for me. Can you actually show them the one up close that you had? I literally cannot reach. Okay, we have to pass them to me. Okay. Mm. This one. Yes, yeah, so that was the one she was eating. Yeah, that's a really funny shape. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Mm. Much better. Wow. Wow, really creamy as well, but oh wow, it's the, 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 the different flavors, are mm -hmm. different layers. Wow, so mm. I'm gonna try the D thousand D six O four even. She is look at these these beauty. <clears throat> Can I try this one? No, there's not a lot of that one. I can't try it. You can try the D6000. Here? Yeah. Mmm. Oh, wow. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh my god, I'm gonna vomit. You're not the durian queen. <laughs> that is seriously... I don't even know what that is. <laughs> this is this one tastes of like... Oh. It's not as sweet as the other one. <laughs> really. Oh my god. This one tastes like the thickest, thickest of sweetish... That was like literally cream. rancid, like mm. spicy... I don't... I, just, I can't describe it. Not good at all. You better try this one there. Oh. How come they're not sweet? Isn't durian supposed to be they sweet? They taste sweet to me. This is like so pungent and bitter to me. Mmm. Crazy. Oh. Oh my god, this one's so good. She is the one as well, man. I like this one a lot. This is probably the best one I've had. It just tastes sweet and creamy to me. No. I don't like bitter things. I don't really like bitter things. Yeah, but I like this. Which one is this one? This? It's got a slight meaty taste as well. That's a D6. This is amazing. Oh, four. <laughs> I've never seen anyone react with <laughs> like that. That was hilarious. I just wasn't expecting it to taste like that like at all. Mm, D6. D6. D14 I've got here. What are you doing? Having the same one. What? Why not? Because you have your own durian. Well, this is shit. <laughs> Shiza. <laughs> that always happens. Every time I get stuff, she always likes my stuff better. Oh, I'm just supposed to sit here while you try all the other ones? Yeah, sure. What? Yeah, and if anyone wonders why I'm not so keen on sharing a lot of my durian, is this costs a lot of money. So, yeah. I'll pay for some of it if you want money. Mm. <laughs> yeah, D14. Mm. Soft, creamy, salt free taste. Not a really strong flavour. Slightly bitterish taste. Definitely not the best one so far. <clears throat> um, let me try some more of this D. I mm. like that one. D604 is the king. 
So one that I've got loads of you don't like. That was unreal. Or did you find this one? No. That's the one that's not named. Can I try that one? Mm hmm Oh, I'm afraid of this one. It smells very... It's very similar. Look at the texture yeah, of it. It's, it's similar. Bitter. Oh. Let's try it as well, shall we? See if it reacts different ways. Oh my god, I'm gonna vomit now. <gasps> now I understand that guy in the airplane. Seriously. <laughs> I met this guy in the airplane that told me the only first and last time he ate during he threw up from it. Now I understand what he means because literally I felt that go in my mouth and I wanted to throw up. This is meant to be a what I do and what I eat day video. Oh I was going to try and do this really muck fan video because this is hilarious. <laughs> See the different reactions between us both. Like for oh. me, I'm like, wow. Oh my god. Mm. I really thought I was going to throw up then. It's so not pungent at all though. Jeez. Oh. <sighs> yeah. That ain't red prawn. Well, it's good that you don't like a lot of them. It means that. Well, can I try that one? Mm hmm. Or I want to. Can I smell them before trying it? Because mm. I can tell. You're going to like all the other ones. Look, you don't like the ones that look like this. Don't eat those ones. Okay, which one? This? T604 is definitely one of my favourite. What one is that? This weird one. Name. Rube by Bong Bing. No idea. I'm afraid. Mm. I'm very afraid. Ooh, but that smells really good. They're all really good, but when you try some, some are really better than the others. So, I still enjoy it, but yeah. She obviously does not like durian because she's not liking a lot of these. I like all the ones in Thailand. First experience I've ever had with someone not asking for something, it's very interesting. Oh, so bitter. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? Okay. Zero. It's strange because the ones she doesn't like are the least flavorful ones. No. What? You don't. What? You didn't like that one. Okay. Mm. Oh wow. Oh, that one's not smelling good. I really like this one, Janessa, don't like. What about this one? Mm. This is 600 again. Really big flat seeds in this one. Are you sure you tried that one? Mm hmm. Hmm. You can try it again. What about that one? I don't know. I think I just looked at that at 600 again. You like that one, so why don't you eat that one? I just want to try different ones. Oh, but you just keep throwing up. <laughs> <laughs> that one doesn't really taste like anything. It's D6000 again. You didn't like D6000. It tastes it? completely different than that one. Mmm. Mmm. This actually. Oh wow. I like this one. You ain't shy in the midst. Mm. See it? Yeah. This one's actually got more of a bitter taste to me than all of them. What? Mmm. <laughs> what? It's got a funny undertone. I know, the undertone is kind of interesting. <laughs> Tastes maybe a slight bit over. Mm hmm. Mm. That's the thing we're doing. You get loads of the same variety, but different ones taste different. Tastes so different than that. Mm. Mm. I actually prefer that one to that one. Well, I tried this. Oh, that one I tried as well. Does it taste different than that one? I haven't tried that one. I mean, this one. 
I prefer this one to the 6000. This one has got some funny little undertones. Mm -hmm. mm. This one's more subtle. No, that's D14. That was a different one. Mm -hmm. I've tried that one actually. I know now because of the name. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. She's pitting out my hard grey, do you? Mmm. That one's good. D14, yeah? Mm hmm. It's actually sweet tasting. Mmm. Mm hmm. But a little bit better too. It didn't taste that sweet to me at all. Like, it's really strange. Your taste buds are obviously completely different to mine. Yes, very. The ones that you keep saying are like horrible tasting are the most subtlest ones, and then you're saying some of the subtle ones are quite sweet. Oh, it is kind of changing flavors though. It's tasting more bitter now. Yeah, this one. This one is very ripe, right? Mm -hmm. Any longer and it began bad. Mm -hmm. mm. It's yeah, right. it could be a slight bit less ripe, but it's still not <clears throat> many, but it's getting there. I still haven't had any that have been blowing my mind. What? Yeah. Yeah, you really like that one. Mm. Like the during we had that D six thousand, it's good. At my house, incredible. Like, and this, this is all the same scene. Mhm. Mm but different. You ain't gonna like that one. That's too ripe for you. Try that one. It smells good. This one's going to, this one's a bit watery. It's a bit overripe. I really like this one. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I don't taste the bitterness, which I like. Hey, it just depends on how ripe they are. Mm. Oh, <clears throat> that one. But yeah. It's good. Mm. You, did, you did try this one. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm -hmm. You tried it. I don't mm -hmm. remember. You really? did? Really? Mm -hmm. No, you told me not to because there's not that much of it. Of course, I don't have any more. Oh, okay. You can try that one then. <laughs> yeah. I oh. actually like quite a bit more savory ones. Yeah, I, do, I do usually. I think I like the sweet ones. Mm. If I could speak. I really like the sweet mm. ones, but after a while eating them, I can feel a little bit sick. Mm. Yeah, that one. Mm, that's the winner. <clears throat> but yeah, definitely doesn't beat Moussan Keen. Is that one sweet or is it bitter? Sweet. Moussan Keen trumps all of these. But it's highly prized durian. Mm. Wow. Alongside black form. Tried getting black form. Moose mm. and King can find it. <clears throat> it just sells out really fast. Mm hmm Moose and King's about 75 bring it a kilo. Black form is about 85 bring it a kilo, but yeah, do you know me? That's a lot. Well like twenty-five dollars a kilo. Mm. This one's stopped taking like sausage now. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, off the top of my head, let me work it out. Mm. Oh god, that's the one. <laughs> oh. 
That one? I don't know. You don't like it? No. What? So bitter and spicy. It tastes like onions. Like exactly like eating like raw onions. Mm -mm. You haven't tried bad monton. Oh my god. That tastes <laughs> like char grilled onions and pepper. I forget which one I liked out of the two. I think it was this one. You're moving that to the camera. What? They want to see them in the camera. I know, but I want to... I can't show them that close because it's... My arm is too short. Oh. I think that was the one I didn't like. I'm pretty much saying like all of them. Well, most of them. I'm kind of sad. I had a lot of expectations. Well, you're in the corner again. I'm not though. Jeez, you want me to be like on top of you? Pretty not. I'm to the side of the table. Yeah, you like the noodle dish we ate last night. <laughs> I liked it because it was starving. But you were you weren't starving, but you were really hungry today. Yeah. As well. How can I predict that I won't? That I'll like it. <clears throat> um. Yeah, man, I'm getting very, very full from this stuff. It's very, very calorie dense. It's a D6 for our gum. Oh, four. Do twelve done. Got more, a lot more left to go. Shu Han, the Tahu Wang sausage. Yeah, I definitely have a bought one doing it. <coughs> uh, yeah, I didn't know how much to buy. I normally buy the shell. Mm. Not in the packet, so yeah, it's a bit really different for me to estimate how much we get. It's not even that I'm getting like too stuffed, it's just a lot, a lot of sweetness. Whew. What's this one? Let's try some of that one, shall we? Sorry for the few cuts, I had to make there's quite a bit of background noise here and there that I couldn't avoid it. I'm gonna stop eating shortly because I can keep stuffing myself full of this, but I don't feel a desire to, because 
Yeah. I'm satiated. And yeah, Chem Dak definitely filled me up a bit. But I know I could eat a lot more if I had something very, very savoury to balance out all this sweetness. And yeah, each bit that I come back to that I've already been to tastes different each time. <laughs> yeah, if they're already, I'm a durian. That are. Since I come to Thailand, that has happened. Yeah, I forgot to mention earlier, mine all comes about 240 or 50 ring it. Just around 2,500 baht. Thai baht. Which is around... Hmm... $78. So a lot of people are going to be like, wow, that's a lot, but it's like people in fine wines. You'll pay a lot of money for the best ones. Yeah, I thought I'd more than likely share more of the ones that I have quite a bit of with Janessa. But yeah, she's gone off. Mm, she doesn't want to eat anymore. She's not very happy about not being that great of experience because she said she's going to have an Asian girl. But yeah, she didn't really get varieties that she liked. She didn't know which one to pick. I didn't know that she wasn't going to like some. And so, uh, yeah. It's one of those things. And this stuff is so calorie dense. Go and look up the calorie of this stuff. So high. One kilo of this flesh is almost 2,000 calories. I don't know how much I've eaten. <laughs> but yeah. I've been eating a lot at all. In the last about four days, we're lucky if I get like 5,000 calories or so. Mm -hmm. So, my refined sea salt will sort me out right now. <laughs> but I don't try that sweetness. Not that I'd add it to the durian. But yeah, Malaysian durians are so strong and dense that compared to Malaysian durian, oh, Thai durian, I can eat loads of Thai durian. This is not as good quality. But this one, no way. So that's the Shu Han done. Shu Han done. Um, Janessa's still got some of hers there. Hmm, let's see this one, show you. Oh, this is that D6000 that has a funny chase going on. That one's my least favourite. Yeah, if you don't like soft, squidgy things, do not try doing it. No, some people just don't like it because of the taste, some people don't like it because of the texture and consistency. Different for each person. With me, I fell in love with it when I first tried the good durian. When I tried bad durian, oh my god, it's horrible. It didn't put me off, I know it wasn't good. 
So I tried again. When I came to him, my first experience was him. Uh, Stephen Hedge actually got it from London. Just before I come to land. That seeds have got piled down here. Looks like um, I'm going to start growing my own durian. Let's try and show you it. <coughs> Look at all of them. <laughs> start our own plantation of durian, shall we? Some of them are really diddy compared to the other ones. Look. Very small in comparison. Hmm, at this one. Hmm, consistent. Mm. This one is so different to the others. Oh, this one is so dense and so sweet. Right, I even got some oniony taste. Oh, that one's pushed me to the limit. I definitely can't eat a lot of that one. Oh. That bit's a little bit on the right. I need that part. Janessa would definitely love me, Sand King. <laughs> Don't see a Moose and King video. I'll put a link up above and down below for it. I made it one a while ago. Last time I was in playing, three months ago. Training now, or training really hard. Yeah, quickly going to that. Yeah, how many tubs did I go through? One, two, three. Nah, oh well, well, actually, more than that because when you look at it, there's a lot more from each one. So let's put that one in there. So let's say five. Right, one, two, three, four, uh, D6000, that one go with the other D6000, five, yeah, around five and a half, <laughs> pretty good going, and we had the Chem deck as well, so yeah, that's it for this video, have any questions? Leave them down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis, such as mukbang videos, calisthenics workout progression videos, or during the day videos, and so many other videos to inspire you, motivate you to become a better version of yourself and create the life of your dreams and create the body that you want as well, um, and the energy levels, and just yeah, the best life that you possibly. Can live like I get to live every single day I get to live the life of my dreams and hopefully I can inspire you and push you in the direction with my videos to do the same as well and teach you some of the information for me to get there as well so yeah if you want to be notified of when new videos are uploaded make sure that when you hit the subscribe button you hit the bell notification button next to the subscribe button otherwise YouTube would not be notified you of when new videos are uploaded so as always stay fit stay energetic and go and get those gains Peace.